The Kentucky approach to the new East End Bridge is three and a half miles of highway in the Prospect area, which is on the east side of Louisville. It includes widening Kentucky 841, also known as the Gene Snyder Freeway, from I-71 to U.S. Highway 42, taking it from two lanes to four. This section includes a new bridge on Wolfpin Branch Road over the Gene Snyder Freeway, a location where Wolfpin Branch used to go under the freeway. Work on widening this section of the freeway is more than halfway finished and is scheduled to be complete in mid-2016. The biggest and most complicated portion of the new highway is building a set of twin tunnels. Each one is a third of a mile long, with entrance and exit portals shown here at 65 feet below the surface grade. The south side portals are located just south of Highway 42. The tunnels proceed under 42 and federally protected property containing a wooded area that was designed by the firm of renowned landscape architect Frederick Law Olmsted. The excavation of both tunnels is complete, but final construction of the liners and other systems will continue well into 2016. From the north side portals, a one-mile stretch of highway is under construction leading to the Ohio River. Approaching the river, the land elevation drops significantly, forcing a transition to a raised highway. This includes a 1,200-foot bridge over Harrods Creek. This shows how it looks under construction with new girders on the bridge piers. And here's how it will appear when finished. The route from Harrods Creek to the Ohio River is less than a mile. About 2,000 feet will be highway on the ground. The other 2,000 feet will be a raised highway as it approaches the bridge. This is because the land is significantly lower on the Kentucky side of the river than it is in Indiana. The last piece of this section is the shared-use pathway for pedestrians and bicyclists leading from River Road up to the 13-foot-wide lane on the bridge, allowing a way for walkers and cyclists to cross the river into Indiana. When complete in late 2016, the new East End Crossing will provide great views of the Ohio River and the terrain in Indiana and Kentucky.